so we want to do a recap and what we want to explain or walk through with you all is kind of show you what happens what's going to happen what's going to happen let's do a recap this is kind of our uh, dry rehearsal Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Multiple Dimensions 1 stage sets. What we're going to do for you is kind of a dry rehearsal of a presentation we're giving in 3D, the first one. So this is the 3D conference area. What's going to happen is that people who arrive for this thing will land in a central landing area, which is called the welcome area. And they're going to pop in like whoosh, like this. And they go, oh my goodness, what's going on here? And some of them are, no, a lot of them are very used to this. It's no big deal. And um, some of them will be very savvy and look, oh, I know what all those regions are. For example, our talk is going to be given in the red box at number one. And, uh, and then our booth is up there in the green box, number three. So, however, we're going to try this one. The people will automatically be whooshed to their the keynote area. And then they'll sit down and, you know, hit escape and then they'll automatically be positioned and see this. So when we give our talk um, ahead of time, we will have behind the stage here, behind the stage, pre-rest our stage set, pre-rest our stage set, which is anywhere here. Here it is, link hybrid tech stage set. And there it is. Now we can't see it yet because we're pretending you're the audience. So, you know, we will get it out of our inventory. It'll be all positioned here. And then when they say you're on, you know, then we bring it forward in front of the stage like that. A little more smoothly than that, we hope. That's why this is a rehearsal. Say, whoop, that's a little bit too too high and bring it down somewhere around there and then 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 we get up as our little avatar and we walk over here and come up the invisible ramp and we start talking hey, ladies and gentlemen and as we showed you we have a script for this welcome to this hybrid tech demonstration sponsored by the conference my name is blah 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 and then we walk through all this. And if this is working right, the people that are close enough could actually click things and go to some of the websites. The other thing is, and you can do this too, folks, get your smartphone out and you can scan these codes. And that's all in the script. We'll be talking about that in, in the script. Okay, that, that's not working there. Good thing we're having this. Oh, well, we know why. Let's see. Edit linked. Move it up to here. Move it up to here. This was not meant to be part of the recap, but you're seeing the magic of composing in three dimensions. These red things are transparent textures, you see. And so anything that has a, oh, look at that. I probably don't want that to be there. Edit linked. Edit linked. Yeah, that's not supposed to be there. Well, I can't, apparently I can't unlink it. So I'll unlink that. Should be able to delete that. 
uh, edit linked, unlink that. So that's gone. Now what is this? Oh, well, we'll leave that one there. We like that one there. Yes, we will. Actually, you know what we'll do is we'll just slide it over to here. We'll just slide it over to there. Because if they click that, I made a point. It doesn't matter. Nobody's going to see that, but that's all right. Okay, so that worked. So now we close that. And then we turn it back to invisible. Oh my god. And see if they click here, they'll, they'll see this. Which will take them here. Which is wonderful. Okay, so what we need to do now, now that we've edited our stage set, this is why this was a dry rehearsal, you see. This is the old one, and we've got to get rid of that. And now we'll just take this, and it magically reappears. Okay, so that's our stage set. That was our quick test. We actually did two stage sets, but that's the one we're working on right now. Now, now, we've got to go back to our booth here and pretend, we'll pretend that we're, we've been, we've went, we went to this presentation, we were enthralled, we were thrilled, and said, oh my god, I want to find out more. And we say, no problem, all you got to do is go see our booth. So now we're going to look at this from the avatar point of view. The avatar point of view. There, okay, the booths are over here, these weird little mushroom things. We start walking over here, and, and it was the second booth on the right. We know that much, and oh, there it is. And it's kind of looking fuzzy right now. We just got to give ourselves a minute. Apparently our, this is the magic. This is the magic of virtual worlds is waiting for your world to resolve around you, or as we like to say, res. Okay, now it's resolved. So now we walk forward and what do we see? We see try me, touch to start, stop. You know, there it goes. It's chugging along here. And then, and then we see this, and then we go in there, and everything's way much taller than we are. And if we know how to alt cam and look, you know, and this flame is flaming, and you know, this is the second, this is stage set number two, which we worked on today, but we didn't show you yet. This is the booth version of what you just saw, and then we come around here. And of course, if we had been coming the other direction, we'd be seeing the booth from that angle. Now, as long as we're kind of, uh, I think that's as much as we're going to do for now. That is as much as we're going to do for now, because we also would like to do a walkthrough and show you some of the other presentations. But we did take pictures. So um, this is the stage set that you just saw us double checking and fixing. And this will be the camera view during the conference. This is the stage set for the second presentation which are the three prompts in the middle and then this is a picture of the booth that we just showed you so this is kind of our trophies um, our ideas for next time and we do have plenty of ideas for next time um well we're going to have a uh, have dress rehearsal Uh, and identify updates to the stage and booth sets and scripts. That's what we're going to do. So we will see you next time. Remember, this is the has been a recap of composing in multiple dimensions one stage sets. And we will be including music, images, and words in here. In fact, we can show you that we've already done a quick music thing. It had nothing to do with our booth, but um, here we experimented with uh, composing. 
turns out you can upload sounds as long as they're under 10 seconds. So we made a 10 second music score. See the music, I told you the music would come in sooner or later. Here it is. This is a very exciting piece called 10 second sound. It's not quite ready to play for us yet. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and um, it sh we should have had room for ten of those. However, because when you export this as an MP3, it adds a little buffer, and if you go over ten seconds, the p this is very unforgiving. And we have a whole new folder called Ten Second Sound somewhere. Here it is, and so this is this this is the sound. Can we play it? Play. Let me turn this up a little bit. Like that, and then we had a script to play that sound. Okay, and then we put it in an object which is this exciting piece of wood. And when you click it, we get a sound. So we had a chance to make a connection between 3D objects and sounds that we record using our, well, we could put any sound you want, but we're interested in music. And, and then we're interested in scripts that would move that stuff. And we would like things to move uh, in conjunction with the sound and boy we are just on the edge of beginning all that so from 3d land <laughs> oh and you haven't heard it there's a sound going on the whole time we're in here that is the sound of the flame and it would be a under 10 second sound that's in a loop so there's all kind of tricks and things you can do so anyway, thank you, as always, for your time, attention, curiosity, and interest. We hope you're looking forward as much as we are to this new series, Composing in Multiple Dimensions. See you next time. Take care, and as always, keep on streaming.